guys, it's Angie. Today we're going to be doing this look from Katy Perry's newest video, E.T. Extraterrestrial. I actually have my own little extraterrestrial co-star in this video. His name is Bowie. He's a pug and he snores throughout this entire tutorial. So I do hope you guys enjoy this look. Um, beautiful, beautiful makeup and it was a lot of fun to do it. So let's get started and thank you for watching. I'm going to start off with a glue stick and a little flat kind of spatula type thing. I'm going to cover my eyebrows with that. Before applying glue to your brows, you want to put a little bit of alcohol to get rid of the excess oil. This will make this a lot easier. So I'm still waiting for my brows to dry. Now I'm going to take my little NYX pencil, my little nubbins. It's sad. And just start filling out my face with that, kind of using it as foundation. This is a really creamy product so you can use your fingers to blend it out or like a makeup sponge, makeup wedge. This could be a makeup look by itself actually. I'm going to go over my brows with the white NYX pencil as well and a concealer brush. This is a white eyeshadow. I'm just going to pat that on with a little powder puff on top of the cream pencil. I'm going to be using Makeup Forever's number 72, this blue here, and an angled brush. I'm going to start to define the scallops on her forehead. They're kind of like around here, and then they round out again, kind of like that. Just fill in up to your hairline with that blue color. The pink I'm going to be using today is Sugar Pills Dolly Pop. It's kind of the perfect pink for this. And a flat kind of shader brush. I'm just going to start applying that to like right here and up here and here where it's concentrated in the picture. Put some in the center here. I'm going to take a small angled brush like this one with that same pink eyeshadow and we're going to start creating these inner shapes that she has and um, it's going to be right kind of underneath the brow and slightly down the nose. You can sort of drag your brush up into the brows to kind of blend it into the brow. Alright, so we're going to continue this out with the blue eyeshadow and just kind of make a shape like that. Maybe a little bit in further. And start blending the blue over this way. You want to apply a white eyeshadow, like a shimmery shadow, to your lid, like halfway across your lid. And draw a little line as well right underneath the eye. Doesn't have to be a perfect line, we'll fix it with a pink shadow that goes underneath. I'm going to fill in this outer half of my lid and make sure it's in that shape. While we're still dipping in the pink, let's go ahead and add the pink underneath the white. And keep that white little line there. Alright, so I've already lined my eyelid in black eyeliner. So I'm going to take this little lash that I made by painting the tips or the ends of the lash with acrylic paint because they do have kind of like a hot pink sheen to them. And I'm going to place that on the outer eye. For the blue line underneath her eye I'm just using a blue face paint from a Mayron Tropical palette and a little brush. I'm just kind of tracing over the line of the pink. I'm going to flick it out a bit on the outer corner. There is a bit of blue mascara on her bottom lashes as well. Just a tiny little detail. In the look, Katie has like some stenciling going on up here. So I've made my own kind of with an index card. Just cut out the design um, with an X-Acto knife. And now I'm going to apply that to my head. To my forehead. Who knew? I did. I'm going to line that up where I think it 
is fairly even and just hold it down and pack on the pink eyeshadow. I'm just going to peel that up and there we have sort of the design. So I've done that for the eyebrow area as well. So in the photo I saw she has this shape towards the side of her face. So we're going to do that with the blue eyeshadow and the angled brush again. Just outline kind of where the shape is going to be. Um, you can see that it's going to be... I'm going to stop like right there. Just a little bit of blue there. And then it's going to go all the way around, curve over, and then go straight up. So that's what we're going to do. Start filling in the blue here. Now I'm just going in with the pink, creating a line. I'm going to go around the face. On this outer edge, you want to start dragging your brush towards your nose so it'll blend out. I like to use a pencil brush and just start working my way inwards. You can pick up some white eyeshadow again and kind of create the line that you want and blend it out. So I'm just kind of filling in the pink on this side. As you can see, it's kind of up further and there's a little bit of white showing. So I'm just going to start working the pink there. And then look in the mirror and kind of see where it meets down here. We're going to do the heart chin now just with an angled brush and the pink eyeshadow. I'm going to line my lips in NYX's electric blue eye pencil. Also going to use Obsessive Compulsive Lip Tar in RX, which is blue. Blue who? I'm gonna grab a little on a Q-tip and just go over the liner. Now I'm just using my finger to dab some navy eyeshadow on top, make it a little darker. It's kind of hard to tell what color her lips are. In the picture I have, they look blue, so. Alright guys, that's it for this look. I hope you enjoyed it. It was a lot of fun to do and uh, I'll be seeing you soon.